Hi, I'm Jess and I run Jessica Kennedy Textiles. Um, I work in a small studio in Northumberland um, and I'm here today, I can show you around a little bit. Uh, I do textile art gifts and stitch cards and um, everything is handmade by me uh, in this little room and hand packed and sent out with a lot of love so it's lovely when you know special pieces go to new homes uh, where people really appreciate handmade. Um, yeah, I do a lot of different things in my work. I look at landscapes sometimes, uh, some, I've looked at memories, I look at stitch sentiments. Sometimes I go back on the machine because my background is in um, freelance embroidery design and in art and textiles teaching. So sometimes I do pop back onto the machine as well and sort of draw on those kind of experiences um, for more um, gift ideas. Um, but I think the thing that underpins all of my work, I suppose, would be my use of vintage and found objects and papers and fabrics. So whether I look at landscape or I look at um, a stitch quote, uh, usually something in that will be reclaimed. Um, sometimes I have an idea and I roll with it. Sometimes the objects that I find are the things that start the idea. So that's quite a nice way to kind of um, develop work uh, and, and also have a good route around at flea markets as well. I'll give you a quick tour of the studio. It's a little bit messy today because I'm making lots of memory bears. Um, memory bears are something I started making in lockdown when I couldn't teach. Teaching makes up quite a lot of my kind of income and time and workshops and kits and things like that. So when I couldn't do that, um, I started making memory bears because my son was a year six lever. Um, and I made one from his school sweatshirt and then from there um, I got some orders which kept me busy over the summer. So they are also on Etsy as well. So I'm making those today, so things are a little bit messy, but this is how it is. This is a studio, it's kind of, sometimes it looks really nice, sometimes it's a complete tip. Um, but I'll show you around and then I'll pop a little slideshow of some images of my work on as well, and I hope you enjoy. So I have a lot of things over here to work with. I usually have my desk right up against here, um, but just for social distancing, when we were able to welcome visitors into the studio, I've moved things around. Um, so my desk is actually now um, in front of the window which is quite nice for light actually it's a lot brighter so there's the machine out ready to make some memory bears today um, it's just a nice small warm room I've got the kettle that's really important always have to be able to make a brew when you're sewing all day so yeah I keep a lot of work up that I've got um, which is listed online it sort of stays up as, a, as inspiration before it sells hopefully it sells um, and then lots of things that I collect as well so you can see lots of bits are just pinned up that aren't developed into work yet. Um, there's things like stamp albums just behind that case there. This is a vintage spoon case that's been given a piece of standing art. So lots of little collected objects, things that I'll just keep until I find the right time or the right thing to explore it with. Uh, and yeah. 